Okay, so I thought for today's tip, I would go over how to use the slicer when you're downloading 3MFs from other sites. Um, so I went ahead and I downloaded a file from Cults 3D and I'm gonna upload it to my slicer. So let's go ahead and add the file to an anglerfish. Um, you can see right here, this one's already all colored and it's a 3MF file. Um, this is very appealing for users because it's already colored. They don't have to mess around with the paint tool. So let's do it. And take a look up here in the upper left corner. You could see that everything changed. Um, this is a bamboo lab. That's not what my printer is. And this is all um, presets that were embedded in the file. Uh, so it really has to be changed back Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to print this. Um, it's, even if it does start printing, it's going to be way off. My printer is not exactly the same as that one. So let's go ahead and switch her back. Now, switching it back means um, that you're going to lose a couple of settings, but not everything. Um, so I'm going to switch it back to my printer preset. Um, is exactly what it sounds like. It's a preset for my printer that has the dimensions um, and a whole lot of other things. If you want to see that, you can always click the edit button and take a look at your preset. I also want to change my filament back to my filament and not their filament. So I'm going to do that just by clicking on the little drop down. You can also click on the little pencil over here and then click up here in this drop down and choose um, any of your presets. Um, and then it's going to go ahead and just pick the top thing um, that's in the list of uh, print profile that you've saved. If you've customized print profiles, saved them, this is where they're going to be. Um, the stock settings are down here. They get kind of pushed down. So this is the one I usually use. Um, it's really good for things like overhangs and uh, loose stringing. I can always tweak any of the settings um, on this print preset if I wanted to. And this file was advertised for not needing any supports. So I don't need to turn supports on. Um, a lot of stuff in here stayed. So if the person who designed this put in support blockers, they're still gonna be there. Um, if they put in support enforcers, they're still gonna be there. Stuff like that will just be kind of hidden um, and stick in there. The most important thing that stayed is the coloring. So our um, coloring on this thing is already ready to jam. Um, if I like these colors, I can keep them. If I want to change them, uh, I am just going to change them here. So if I don't have this shade of blue, uh, which I do, but if I didn't have it and I had a different blue or a different green or what any color that I have and that I want to use, I can absolutely change it like that. Changing the color using the painting tools, probably not ideal. Um, not for this kind of model. So it looks like in our object list, we have three items. We have the body, the head, and the fin. It's a really cute model. I like it. This part here is flexy. So when you pull it off the build plate, um, it's all wiggly and you know it can dangle in front of the anglerfish's mouth like it's supposed to. I really like the colors that the um, designer has already picked for this model. I like it a lot. Not sure anything else needs to be done for this one. It looks like they already put a breakaway brim on here. If you look really closely, right here they have these little tabs that look like they break away. Um, this is so if somebody like myself, an end user, downloads this file, and then prints it without having their brim on, um, they don't lose the whole model and get really upset because they lost adhesion.
So that's how to successfully download a 3MF and alter it back to your um, printer settings so that it successfully prints. You don't want to um, just download and print if it's 3MF and it's colored and everything, it's going to be all messed up. If you're enjoying this content, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much.